different kind of video today. I've never done one of these kind of like YouTube reaction videos before, but I just so happen to be sitting here when this uh, diss track uh, reply from Eminem just went live to Machine Gun Kelly. I would never do a kind of video like this, but I'm actually a fan of Eminem and I've been watching him since I was really young. I used to warm up to basketball games, listening to his stuff, lose yourself till I collapse, you know, classics like that. I saw this, uh, you know, diss track from Machine Gun Kelly when it came out last week, I think it was, and kind of catchy. I didn't think it had that many good disses in it, considering I don't really know how you can um, successfully rip some guy who's way more successful than you. But uh, anyway, so I'm going to make a reaction to the video. So uh, let's check it out. Oh, that was good. That was really good. It's your moment. This is it. As big as you're going to get. So enjoy it. Had to give you a career to destroy it. Okay, that was pretty good. <laughs> oh man, that was pretty good. Machine Gun Kelly, his song was actually, it was somewhat catchy. It wasn't necessarily full of like insane disses in my opinion though. And one thing I really don't understand is why these guys, when they diss older people, like Eminem's in his 40s, but... He's had insane success. And then you have this guy who's 28, I think, 28. He's not, like, insanely young. And then he's talking about this 45-year-old who's way more successful and was more successful at his age, arguably. Like, beaking him for just being old. Just for, like, I don't know why that's, like, the go-to diss is, like, if you're pat in your 30s or older, then, you know, you're just, like, you can't do anything for some reason. I don't understand why that's like the go-to diss, especially if you're in your 20s, is like you're a loser for doing anything because you're older than you're not like 22 or something. It makes zero sense to me, especially when you're insulting somebody who's like a legend for stuff he did in his 20s. <laughs> well, obviously he has to come up with something to diss Eminem because there's not a whole lot you can go off of. But uh, I think he probably just did this to like bring more attention to himself because at the end of the day... Uh, what is it? All publicity is good publicity or whatever, even if it's bad. And obviously a lot more people are talking about this guy now, regardless if they think he won this battle or not. I think it's pretty, I think it's pretty obvious Eminem just destructed this guy. I feel like a lot of people do think Eminem's like washed up and stuff because he's in his 40s. But it's like if you were born in the 90s or before that, you should be able to relate more so to his stuff than MGKs in my opinion. I'm only I'm 26. It's not like I'm old. I'm younger at MGK and Eminem is still somebody I would uh I don't consider him like irrelevant at all. Man, for somebody who is in their 20s who had like a hair transplant in their mid 20s and talk dissing a guy for being old, that to me that's like so ironic. But uh I'm surprised that it didn't make it into the diss track by the way cuz if you look it up Machine Gun Kelly used to have an insanely receding hairline when he was in his early 20s. And then he got it fixed with surgery, or not surgery, cosmetic, whatever you would call it, where you you would get uh, hairs transplanted off of the back of your head and put them into your scalp. And he has the scar on the back of his head from when he got that done. So it's pretty obvious that he had a hair transplant done. That was like in his early, mid-20s. And the guy's... The guy's uh, insulting people for being old and irrelevant. And it's like, not that that should constitute anything bad, but I mean, like, how can you insult a guy on his age when you're, like, 
you're almost 30 and you've th- that's what's happened probably a success for him at the end of the day even if everyone thinks he lost though realistically i'm surprised i mean i'm responded to be honest because uh at the end of the day he just put way more he just put this guy's name on the map realistically by doing this whole you know diss track thing with him anyway i think eminem definitely takes it i don't think it's uh any comparison there but then again i'm an eminem fan not as much of a fan of the other guy to be honest and i grew up listening to eminem and i think uh i think anybody taking shots at him saying he's irrelevant and stuff like that is just you know trying to blow their own name up pretty obvious to me anyways that's what my thoughts let me know what you guys think in the comments below uh like subscribe check out my other stuff if you haven't more plates more days.com subscribe there talk to you guys soon